friends, Monica Peters. Today is April 8th. Real short video, just a few of many reasons why I prefer Git and GitHub over SVN. Here is a private repository I have. Um, we can use a web browser to look at all the demographics, um, graphs, the activity with this project right in a web browser. So you can see these are 47 commits. You can see who the developer is that did all of these code commits. And when they started, it started on February 15th. It ended on March 5th. You can see graphs. And all of this is automatically generated. The developer you know, does the, the normal command line interface for you know, uploading their code and keeping it updated. But uh, all of this type of stuff is created automatically when a developer just does what the developer normally does. So we have all these graphs, which are great for the rest of the development team, like say um, for executives that are making decisions on where they're investing uh, you know, their resources into a project. So they can see, like in this particular project, so there was three days where there was actual work going on as far as code going committed right to the repository. You can see how often. There's even a punch card, and it's all in graphs. Um, just all different settings can be used and this can be quickly shared with uh, the whole entire team for a project including people that are not software developers. The uh, I don't know there's tons of the other thing is a wiki that's automatically generated the developer doesn't have to do anything extra it's automatically created um, for every project with GitHub. Issues uh, you know a project manager that's not a software developer can use a web browser and say hey especially when we're doing usability tests and things on a mobile app this is great because a non-software developer can create an issue assign it to anyone on the development team even create milestones assign that all in a web browser which is really nice to keep the whole team and everything cohesive the other thing is settings you know you can add and you know remove developers to this code repository without giving um, access to too much info especially because that could be a concern with a really new development team or a new develop software developer so that's just a few reasons why I love Git GitHub over just plain old SVN um, they're not all the same they all three of them do provide version control Git and GitHub though is decentralized so the version control um, like we have it but it works differently. The developer does not need to be connected to the server inside a company in order to work on their own local copy of the repository and they can not even have internet access and still work on the local copy of the repository and still get all of the version control features that we expect from things like SVN. That's all I have to say about this. Um, I could talk on and on for the rest of my career about how much I love Git and GitHub, but I think you've heard enough from me about this right now.